As Memphis's name was called, the team wasn't even there to hear it. We went into the locker room to talk to the team after the game, and they were like, we have to go up. And then right when we were walking in the hallway, they were like, it just announced. An anticlimactic way for the Tigers to find out that after eight long years, they are back in the NCAA tournament. Now, the team was clearly still deflated after the championship game lost to Houston, but Penny said the celebration will set in soon enough. The competitive nature in us is just not going to be elated and just forget what just happened an hour ago, but, you know, we will be excited when we go to Portland. The Tigers are the nine seed paired up with Boise State in the first round. Chet Holmgren and top seed Gonzaga loom in the round of 32. But in year four under Penny Hardaway, Sunday's selection represents a promise fulfilled to Tiger Nation. Doing it with so many Memphians on the roster made it that much sweeter. Being in their shoes, being in their uniforms, and then having them have an opportunity now to experience the NCAA is even better because, you know, that's what we set out to do. Those are always a childhood dream. Uh, one day just coming, playing for your home, and then again to the to the tournament. You know, I came back, you know, I want to be a part of this team and, you know, make it to the NCAA tournament. You know, we didn't get to see we wanted, but it's still a great feeling that we're going to get the opportunity to go down and play in the NCAA tournament. It's, it's a great feeling. I mean, I I know where this came, this came from and then where it's going and where it's headed, and it's headed in the right direction. And that direction is Portland. After a quick pit stop in Memphis, the Tigers will fly out to Oregon on Tuesday. In Fort Worth, Texas, I'm Clayton Collier.